Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about what you can expect to see from CF Moto in the 2024 lineup, as well as a few rumors, maybe, and maybe a few of our wish lists that we hope to see coming our way. Let's get in it. So, the biggest news and most exciting thing that we saw from 2023 from CF Moto was the Gen 2 Z Force 800 and 950 Trail as well as the Gen 2 Z Force 950 Sport you see right here. They've already proven to be a very popular item and a lot of people are really liking the style over the previous year model, as well as the custom ability that you can do. There's already a bunch of accessories out for them and this Team MSC build here, simple but very unique, just changing the wheels and tires, Team MSC tinted windshield, and that's about it and this unit looks awesome. Also for 2023, the Z-Force 950 HOEX that you see here remain to be CF Moto's flagship sport side by side, but is that gonna be the case for 2024? And when Team MSC released this build here, their Z-Force 950 HOEX short course race unit, uh, man, it got people pumped up and excited about what the future could look like with a Z-Force or sport side-by-side -side from CF Moto that has over 100 horsepower. This unit showed out, has beat turbo units on short course tracks, and uh, Team MSC did a good job of getting all of us excited about what could be in the future for CF Moto. And with that being said, there are a bunch of rumors floating around in the CF Moto community about what they could be bringing to the table. There's been talks about a triple cylinder engine. There's been just all kinds of good, juicy rumors. And uh, right now, y'all hash that out down in the comment section. Talk about what you think is coming. Talk about what you hope is coming. I'd love to interact with you down in the comment section. What does CF Moto have up their sleeve? Now we'll come back to the topic of the side-by-sides in just a moment, but let's jump to the C-Force lineup. The only thing that we saw different in 2023 was with the 2023 C-Force 600, which saw some much needed horsepower gains and a few other cool modifications like drive mode. And uh, they did some uh, insulation around the exhaust, did some much needed upgrades to it. And it's been a great unit as well. C-Force 500, it had kind of a negative change and that was going away from the painted plastics. Other than that, still an amazing unit loaded with features at a ridiculously uh, affordable price in the C-Force 500. C-Force 400 as well, didn't really see any changes, but the uh, C-Force 1000 Overland and the C-Force 800, which is off screen right now, they didn't see any changes, uh, especially the Overland. C-Force 800 saw a few graphic changes, but that was it. So with that being said, is it time? Are they about to do something big and crazy? Uh, what's some things you'd love to see in the 2024 lineup? I know one thing, is that many of you are looking for a V-twin like the C-Force 1000 engine to be in a single seater format, the short wheelbase. Are we gonna see that? I don't know. Have you heard anything? Comment down in the comment section. Would you love to see that? Would you love to see it built off of the 600 frame, C-Force 500, a whole new chassis? I know one thing I'd like to see. I'd like to see a CF Moto come out with a scrambler version or a renegade version, what would you like to see? That'd be pretty cool. And before we talk about the U-Force category, the utility side-by-side -side from CF Moto, let's talk about the motorcycles real quick because many of you are into dual sport, uh, such as when I say that, I don't mean dual sport motorcycle, but you like being able to go off-road in your side-by-side -side or ATV, as well as hopping on a motorcycle and enjoying some street touring uh, enjoying cruising around the back roads or town or the highways, whatever the case may be. So with that being said, let's give just a quick moment to the motorcycle lineup. We know that CF Moto excited many people with the release of the Ibex 800. What a torque monster it is. Great looking motorcycle. Uh, will we see more from CF Moto? I know that from CF Moto official, we have seen uh, the 800 NK. So I expect that to be the same power uh, curve and torque and horsepower as what we see in the 800 Ibex. So that is gonna be very exciting. That will be the big brother to the 650 
NK. There's also some other cool things that I've seen overseas. So what will we see in the US coming up in 2024 lineup? You tell me what you have heard and what you would love to see if you're into the motorcycle lineup. One thing I do know, it's gonna be exciting. The more people see these motorcycles in person and get to test drive them, look them over, they realize, man, these are super high quality motorcycles and they really, really wanna get them because they're affordable, great warranty, great customer service, especially if you get it from a dealer like Main Street Cycle, you can't go wrong. So what do you hope to see in 2024? To get to the U-Force lineup, what a popular lineup it is because they're so hard to get your hands on. I know here at Main Street Cycle, as soon as they get any U-Forces in, especially the U-Force 1000 and the 1000 six-seater, they are gone before the end of the day near about it. So we actually just happened to have gotten a couple of 600s in and uh, I think they're actually selling the last 1000 six-seater this week. So yeah, they're super popular. The demand is extremely high and they're just great units. So right now, all that you have in the lineup is the U-Force 600, as you see here. Then you've got a U-Force 1000 three-seater and then the U-Force 1000 six-seater. And uh, super great units, plenty of power, comforts there. It's everything that you could possibly want in a utility machine. So with that being said, will we see something added to the U-Force lineup? Will they bring the 800 twin cylinder engine into this particular model, the body style, the two seater? I don't know. I honestly, I haven't heard that rumor, but it would be cool to see since they did do away with the U-Force 800, the old body style that looked more similar to a Can-Am Commander, if you will, with the bucket seats and the dump bed. So uh, yeah, use this moment now. I'd love to see what you would really love to see from CF Moto in their U-Force lineup. Uh, I know some people are what, ready to see a, a complete sealed cab with air conditioning and heating. Will we see that? Not really sure, but comment down in the comment section what you think, what you'd love to see from CF Moto in their U-Force lineup. All right, now to wrap things up about the 2024 lineup from CF Moto, they have kept everything pretty much under lock and key. I know a few things have gotten released from other countries that wasn't supposed to. Uh, there are some exciting things that I believe you're gonna see coming in the near future. The 2023 lineup has been absolutely awesome and we have plenty of inventory here at Main Street Cycle. So listen, they are great, awesome machines. The 2023 C4 600, the 500, even the 400, awesome machines at an amazing price that you can actually afford and not rip you off like some of the other manufacturers who are constantly just increasing their prices by not just hundreds, but over a thousand dollars with each releasing year. It's getting out of control. But thanks to CF Moto, they are continuing to release great quality, premium performing units in the utility division, the sport side by side, and the ATV utility segment, as well as they just released the C-Force 110s for the youth uh, age, and they are proven to be great machines as well at such a great price. So again, exciting things coming in 2024. I know that many of you are hoping to see a four seat sport side by side. We've been talking about that for a couple of years now. Uh, many of us wanna see a Seaforce 800 or 1000 uh, mud build straight from the factory. Uh, of course, they haven't released that yet, but I know that they are listening. So any of those reviews that you send in, if you do purchase a CF Moto, CF Moto reads those and they are taking things into consideration as they make changes with every model year that comes out. So I hope you enjoyed this type of video. I uh, hope that you are taking advantage of the comment section. Comment, let's have a conversation. What you'd love to see from CF Moto in the coming release of the 2024 CF Moto lineup on the on-road segment and the off-road. I know some of you, the top things is probably more power from the sport side by side. Many of you want to see the breaking through of the 100 horsepower barrier. Some of you want to see a turbo. 
Some of you are wanting to see a single seat version of the 800 or 1000 ATV. Many of you are wanting a he heating and cooled uh, U-Force 1000. Well, are they gonna bring that to the lineup in 2024? We'll just have to find out. Stay tuned to this channel because I will be sure to bring you that news as soon as it is officially released right here at Real Talk Power Sports YouTube channel. Make sure you follow me on uh, Facebook. You can look up Real Talk Power Sports on Facebook as well as join our MSC CF Moto group. Uh, there you will see many great things such as pictures, videos, release of different information. You can find it all there on the MSC CF Moto group. Uh, also, I'm at Team MSC Racing on TikTok. Make sure you follow me there as well. I release a bunch of cool videos on there. Uh, a lot of cool things coming. Make sure you visit TeamMSC.com for all of your performance parts needs, accessories, performance parts. We've got you covered at TeamMSC.com. Hope you enjoyed this video. God bless you. As always, remember to keep it real. We'll see you in the next one.